MiG-21, Uncovering the Truth Behind the Legendary Fighter Jet The MiG-21 is a Soviet-designed supersonic fighter aircraft that was first introduced into service in 1959. It has become one of the most recognizable and widely used military aircraft in the world, with over 11,000 units produced across various variants and exported to over 60 countries. The MiG-21 played a major role in the Cold War and saw extensive use in numerous conflicts throughout the latter half of the 20th century. Design and Development The development of the MiG-21 began in the early 1950s, as the Soviet Union sought to create a new generation of jet fighters that could outperform the rapidly advancing designs of the West. The project was led by Mikoyan Gurevich, hence the MiG designation, with the goal of creating a small, lightweight, and highly maneuverable aircraft that could operate at supersonic speeds. The first prototype, designated the Yi-2, made its maiden flight in 1955. The aircraft featured a delta wing design, which allowed for high agility and stability at high speeds, and was powered by a single Tumansky R11 turbojet engine. The Yi-2 underwent several modifications before being designated the MiG-21F and entering production in 1959. The MiG-21F was followed by several other variants, including the MiG-21PF, which featured an improved radar system and a more powerful engine, and the MiG-21S, which introduced a new cockpit layout and improved avionics. Operational History the MiG-21 first saw combat during the Vietnam War, where it was used extensively by North Vietnamese Air Force pilots against American and South Vietnamese forces. Despite being outmatched in terms of technology and firepower, the MiG-21's small size and agility made it a formidable opponent in dogfights. The MiG-21 also saw extensive use in other conflicts throughout the Cold War, including the Arab-Israeli Wars of the 1960s and 1970s, the Indo-Pakistani Wars of the same era, and the Soviet-Afghan War of the 1980s. In addition to its combat roles, the MiG-21 has also been used for reconnaissance, ground attack, and even as a trainer aircraft. Many countries continue to operate the MiG-21 to this day, although the aircraft's age and declining availability of spare parts have led to a decline in its operational use in recent years. The MiG-21 is a single-seat, single-engine aircraft with a delta wing design. It measures 14.7 meters in length, 4.8 meters in height, and has a wingspan of 7.15 meters. The aircraft's maximum takeoff weight is 9,700 kg. The MiG-21 is powered by a single Tumansky R25-300 turbojet engine, which provides a maximum thrust of 63.75 kN. The aircraft has a maximum speed of Mach 2.05, 2,448 km h at high altitude, and a maximum range of 1,200 km with drop tanks. The MiG-21's armament consists of a single 23mm GSH-23 cannon mounted in the nose, as well as up to four air-to-air -air missiles and or air-to-ground rockets or bombs. The aircraft also features a radar system and advanced avionics, including a helmet-mounted sight system for targeting missiles. The MiG-21 has undergone numerous variants and upgrades throughout its operational history. Some of the most notable include MiG-21F, the first production variant of the MiG-21, featuring a single Tumansky R-11. The MiG-21 is a supersonic fighter aircraft that was introduced into service in 1959 and remains in service with some countries to this day. It has a distinctive delta wing design, which allows for high agility and stability at high speeds. The MiG-21 played a major role in the Vietnam War and saw extensive use in numerous conflicts throughout the latter half of the 20th century. It is powered by a single Tumansky turbojet engine, providing a maximum thrust of 63.75 kN. The aircraft is armed with a single 23mm cannon and up to four air-to-air -air missiles and or air-to-ground rockets or bombs. 
The MiG-21 has undergone numerous variants and upgrades throughout its operational history, with the MiG-21F being the first production variant. Despite its declining use in recent years, the MiG-21 remains a highly recognizable and widely used military aircraft, with over 11,000 units produced across various variants and exported to over 60 countries.